Welcome to the 2019 NCAA Division III Championships first round post-game press conference for the game between Hanover and Wheaton. With us from Wheaton is head coach Mike Schauer and student athlete Ashton Francis. We'll begin with an opening statement from Coach Schauer and then open the floor for questions. Yeah, it was a great game. I mean, obviously, uh, you know, Hanover is really good. I thought going into the ten uh, tonight's game, you know, we had two teams that were they were pretty driven by, by uh, particularly offensive by an individual player. Cam fails for them, and obviously Aston for us. And um, I think one of the big differences is uh, we see teams like Hanover a lot in our league, which isn't to diminish how good they are. It's actually to recognize how good they are. But I thought that was a, an advantage for us. Um, it actually reminded us a little bit of a team in our league. And, and you know, Luke Peters guards guys like Cam all the time. If you look at you know the the Jostens, uh, trophy awards that came out as a finalist. He's guarded Ben Boots, he guards Aston sometimes in practice, he just guarded Cam, he's guarded the young man from Platteville. Luke's played everybody this year, so as good as Cam is, and he's really good. Uh, I felt like we had, a, you know, we had a matchup for him, and I thought that was as, as significant as Aston's scoring tonight. So both of you, uh, a little sluggish in the first five or six minutes of the first half, but Luke Anthony hit uh, a couple buckets and then you got going Aston. Did you feel like it took a few minutes to get uh, some momentum going, or was there? Yeah, he, he'll answer his perspective on it. It looked like both teams were playing the first game of the NCAA tournament, and yeah. we're just a little too too jacked up, really. I mean, it, it was one of those things where it was hard to kind of catch your breath and get your get your emotions under control a little bit. Um, and I thought, but we really settled down and started to make shots. But I thought early it kind of looked like both teams were a little anxious. Yeah, emotions were uh, definitely running high you could feel a little bit. So once both teams kind of settled down, you know, and got that first shot to fall. Like Coach mentioned, Aston, you've played a, been against a lot of good players this season and in your career. Is there any different feeling when you know you're going offensively, you are a good player, as well as Cam Fields a good player? Is there anything different for you in your mindset? Or? Um, you know, preparation wise, no. Um, but, you know, I'd be lying if I said, you know, you don't know if you're going up against a high caliber player. Um, and I think you know any good player is gonna gonna want that challenge and enjoy that moment playing against you know other other really talented guards. Um, and fortunately, we've got Luke uh, to to guard guys like that, and he does a great job on them um, and kind of overshadows where I'm lacking on that end of the floor. So, coach, you got a lot of nice performances from a variety of guys tonight. Luke Anthony played well. Jay had a double double, a, a well-rounded effort from you. Talk, talk about what that means to. As you advance on to, to get a, a game like that from a lot of guys. Yeah, you know, Luke Anthony's played pretty well since since we've you know gotten him. We've kind of put him into the into the rotation. He is just a phenomenal shooter. He's got a little bit. I've said this to you before. He's got kind of that clutch gene a little bit. He's willing to take and make big shots. We've run a lot of times in those situations. You know, they cut it to six and. Um, we run a set to him. Uh, he's hit a lot of those shots that really once that one went in, mathematically it got tough for them. Um, and he's hit a ton of those shots and he's just such a great shooter and he kind of, he makes it difficult to play Aston when you leave guys because he's, I don't know what he's shooting now from three, but it's got to be in the high, high 40s. Um, and so it makes it a little harder to double Aston because he's on the floor. Uh, and, you know, Jay's been good all year, uh, really. Jay's a, Jay's a really talented young man who does a lot of good things for us. And he's a little bit unsung at times like Luke Peters because he does a lot of the dirty work for us. He guards the best teams forward, rebounds the ball. He's, he's a high IQ player. He shares the ball. He's really a complete player. He does a lot of things well. Um, I thought that was significant. And certainly moving forward here, whether it's Baruch or Mooser, we're going to need to be to continue to have guys in the trip. This question for both of you, what does it mean to just get the first win under your belt in the tournament and see where things go from there? I thought tonight was a big two. It was our 20th win. You know, I told the guys in the locker room, yeah. you kind of want to celebrate some milestones. It's one of those things that people check, right? Uh, it's a 20-win season, quote-unquote. I thought that was significant. Um, yeah, I think, I mean, any NCAA tournament win is big. Uh, and and we, I think we're looking forward to the challenge if it is Worcester to play them on the road. That's kind of our world, right? Illinois West, and Augustana, and North Central. This team's been at Whitworth, we've you know, been at Platteville. It's kind of our world, and I think we're kind of looking forward to that challenge. But I mean, it's survived in advance, so anytime you get one, it's, it's fun. To, you know, I told our guys at, at shoot around this morning, our goal was to be here tomorrow, right? That's our goal, be at shoot around tomorrow. Be, be practicing one day, that's the goal, so. Uh, yeah, you know, no, no bad teams in NCAA tournament, so uh, we'll get geared up to play uh, each and every game. And uh, we talked about in uh, the locker room before the game, you don't want to come to the dance and, and not go out there and sit on the side. You want to go get in there and uh, dance a little bit. So uh, nice to get a win and, and keep on going. Hopefully we can just play well tomorrow. Yeah. Thanks.
Thank you, Coach Shower and Dr. Francis, to our students.